Hi, everybody. It's Susie Fat Bang now. Um, thank you so much for joining my channel. If you saw my video last night, it was probably about mm, 2 o'clock at night. And I bought some nail polish from my job. And I really want to do a Christmas color. This morning I woke up. I looked at my nails. I was really, 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 really not happy. They dry pretty good than I thought of. But it's just like, I'll show it to you. This one is called WF Nail Polish. It has a like glitter to it and everything. I used this one last night. My husband's in the background talking to his doctor. And this one was OPI Gel Color. Ready Why for the Holidays. It doesn't say anything about a, um, a, like a light thing or anything. It talks about soak off. And that's probably where I went wrong. I didn't. You need to soak this sucker off because this thing does not come off that easy. It does not. Um, I was really, really disappointed using this one. I like OPI. Would I give it a try again? Using it by itself, it was really nice. It gave a nice shine. But it was just plain and simple. I don't think, for me personally, I've tried gel before. That one I bought years ago, that one needed a light. This one, you don't need a light. And I was really kind of disappointed with this one. So I don't think I'm going to use this again. And what I did, basically, this is what I did. And I pop, that's probably what the problem was. I did the OPI um, gel first on my nails. Then I put this on. Then on different nail, I put this on and put the gel on top of it. And then vice versa. And I think that's where the mix-up was and everything. So to be honest with you, I love OPI. I do. Open product is my go-to nail. It's my go-to nail polish. But the OPI gel color, I I'm not feeling this. I'm just not feeling this. I'll have to do more research and see what I did wrong. Um, do I want to try it again? I had this on my nails. I took this off just today, and it was like I had to get like get a container to soak my nails in. Really soak it in, and I was just it was saturated with nail polish remover. And I'm using the um strengthened nail polish remover for natural nails with K, K A R A T I N. So that was fine, everything. And I have my little this now is my little bowl for my nail polish remover. But like I said, I could have done it wrong, but. This is my review, what I think. And I'm going to do a lot of review on nail polish and how long it lasts. Do I like it? I could have done it wrong. I could have not let it uh, dry. I'm going to be investing in a nail dryer real soon. And I like, that's still like totally like old school type of thing. But I was really, really disappointed in the OPI gel color. I really, I see ladies have it. And I wanted to have that look for the holidays. And it just, it, it, it didn't happen. So, I'm taking this one back. I'm really kind of disappointed in that one. Now, with this one right here, it has a beautiful color to it. Nice, beautiful color. I might go ahead and give this a try again. This I put like two coats on, and it's beautiful. It's, it's just beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. And I like this. So, I think I'm going to wear this again. Put it on. I had... Like, I had this hand in my video, if you saw my YouTube video, this hand did not have gel. It was just a nail polish. And it looked real, real beautiful. So, I'm thinking, what I did last night, I had this hand, I had just a nail polish itself. And it was beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. So, I don't think I'm going to do the OPI gel again. I want to show you some other nail polish I have. I have... Sally Hansen Instant Dry. It's a red color. And the name of this one is called... Put my glasses on. That would help if I had my glasses on. This one is called... That's a... It's three, the number is three, 390. It's hard to read what, the, what the, it says and everything. But the number is 390. So it's with... um. Sally Hansen, they come with different numbers. So this one is 390. It's instant dry. I mean, it's going to be drying like real, real fast and everything. So I might give this one a try before I go to work today. 
And we all know I went out and it was on Thanksgiving. So I bought myself some nail polish. I got like four. And the lady was such a blessed night with a short, like maybe a dollar or whatever. And she really blessed me. She just bought the nail polish. She gave me four nail polish. I told her I do YouTube videos and, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm trying out different nail polish. And she said, here you go. What's your channel? And she, she subscribed. And I was like, wow, thank you. So with Papa Arazzi, that's how I call it, P-O-P-A-R-A-Z-Z-I. -Z and I'll put the name on top. I found this one to be really, really nice. It's um, how long does it last? I would say when I first used it, I put one coat on. I would say two coats are really good with this brand and everything. It does. I have noticed a little bit like on the side, a little chipping of the, not your nail, but the, the color itself. But I'm going to give it a try again. Because I think since I'm, when I'm doing my nails, I'm like in a rush. When I'm doing the process of, you know, cleaning it and everything, I'm going to take my time. But I realize you have to take it. If you're going to wear nail polish, you can't just put it on any kind of way. You have to really take your time. I have to say good things about this. Let me grab my, I have my nail bag. I have to get a container for all my nail polish and stuff, you know. So I want to show you. And you might say, yeah, I went shopping, okay? So I have that. And I made a video on this pink one. The pink is really beautiful. Beautiful color. <laughs> Sorry, I had to sneeze. <clears throat> it's all dusty. And time to paint. I have this really house paint. This is my favorite. Oh my gosh. This is so beautiful. I think I showed this before. And I love this. It's so beautiful. It's it's um beautiful oil. And if I can see it in the light, this is cuticle oil. And what I love about this one, it has the little flowers inside of it. It is so cute. So sometimes when I go to work, I don't have time to do anything. And I just want to, you know, my nails to be sh shiny. I put the cuticle oil on and it just has a nice effect on it. Let me dump this out so you can see what I got. It's very important too when you buy nail stuff, don't. And I think that's what the problem was when I did the OPI gel then I put this was not OPI this is W7 and I blend them together I think it's very important I think that was my that was totally my mistake I think they're very it's very important if you're going to use a nail product for your nails stick with the same brand and the reason I say that is let me get this on my bag and I'll show you what I'm talking about I bought this right here And this is by Sally Hansen. I have none but good things to say about this. This is number 55. It's drinking and base coat. Even I have the OPI and it works really good. I did this first. What products? I did my um cuticle oil. And but I, I did this too right here. And this one is a I have my glasses on. This is a strengthening base coat. So this helps strengthen your nail everything. My husband's talking to his doctor, so he's in the background. But this is really good. It has a nice shine to it. I'm, I'm really in love with this. I would not take this back. I would give this on the scale from 1 to 10. I'll give it a 10. I would really look at this right here. I would give this a 10. That's not even an option. I would give it a 10. And I went to work. I had this. My other video, I don't know if you're sure I saw it or not. Um... This one here is Sally Hansen. I hope you can see it with the light. I apologize. It's a uh, color therapy. It's sheer. You look like a sheer look. And the number for that one is 220. So you have 555. Five, five. That's the number for this one. Then the other number for this one is 220. Two, two, and these two combined together. Beautiful. Beautiful. I mean, I got the look I wanted. It was sheer. It was just, just beautiful. So what I would say is when you buy nail polish, don't really blend in different nail polish with diff different nail polish unless they're the same brand. I think that's what happened. I did, you know, by doing my nails with the OPI 
and wanted it to have a lot of shine to it. I had a different nail polish. If I had to do it all over again, I would probably do a OPI glitter one if I could find it. Then probably put the gel over it. But for right now, on a scale of 1 to 10, I would have to say the gel, and it just is me. And forgive me for you, some of you out there who love your gel. Your girl gives it a three. I, I give it a three. I'm really not excited with it. I, I think I'm going to take this one back today. I uh, got it my job and everything. So I was not really excited with this gel, this gel thing. And it does say in the back, which I didn't re realize until I read it, it says soak off. So basically, I was trying to take it off of my nail polish and the cotton and everything, and it wasn't happening. It wasn't happening because I was supposed to soak this bad boy off. So, yeah, this one is going back. When I want to take it back, maybe today of time, I got to find my receipt and everything. So that's, I'm not going to go with that. I'm very disappointed with that. Um, This one I got for my job, and it's called W7. I think I'm going to give this a try again sometime this week. I'm going to give that a try. I'm not even going to try if I go to work today. I have to work at 4 o'clock today, so... I might give this a try. I really love the color in this. Uh, it just it's it's got a nice glow to it. It's beautiful. So then I have um I'm gonna show you my collection here. I have Sally Hansen again, hardest nail. This number is 470. I haven't opened it yet or tried it yet, so I can give you a review on this one. But I really like the color of it and everything. But Sally Hansen, I have noticed that their nail polish is really, really, really good. I love uh, OPI is my number 10. I need to rent number 10. Uh, Sally Hansen, a 10. Um, Bobby Pla Pla uh, Araza, maybe I'm saying anything wrong or not. I have to give this a 10. I really have to give it a 10. You know, I tried it. I don't have a negative to say about it. It seemed like it kind of chipped a little bit. But then again, I want to try that over again. The one I did not like was the OPI gel. So I'm going to look a little more vi videos on OPI gel reviews. And maybe I did it wrong. Maybe I did it wrong. So I'm willing to give it a try again. And again, I have this other one. And this is, I don't have my glasses on. Grim something. I can't pronounce it. It's like a darkish red color. It's beautiful. And I ha I think I tried in my one video. I have all these different nail polish on. So that one's really good too. This is really, really creamy color. Very, very creamy. I liked it and everything. But your girl and Sally, these two, I love it. I love these two a lot. These, it just gave my nails a very beautiful look. I kept it on for about three na three days and I took it off and I regret it because my nails look really good. It had a natural look to it and everything. Um, if I had to, I need to go back to do my open eye treatment. And when I want to take it off, I will put this on. This is just really, that's a go-to right there. And my other collection, I have to go house collection here now. And I'm going to set up... Um, Get a container for all my nail polish and nail stuff. Then I have this one from Pavarotti. It's really pretty. It with this you have to be careful to put this one on. You have to really keep it on thick, real light. It takes a while for the glitter to go on and everything, you know. From a one to ten, I would give this one an eight. You know, I give it an eight. It's real beautiful and everything. Um, this is Sally Hansen again. I love the color. It's so beautiful. I haven't tried it on yet, so I'm looking to it for work and everything. But Sally Hansen, it just, I have no more good thing to say about it. Good, good thing. And here's Sally Hansen Diamond Strength. It's just no chip, no chip, color, nail color, verse, contra, verse something, um, anti, E C A I L L E S. Don't quote me on that. I don't have no glasses on right now. But this is the color of it. That's real pretty. 
and I'm not putting this one on today. So I'm really kind of debating my colors of the other day and stuff. And those are my collection of nail polish. So, yes, I took the gel off today. And when it says soaking, I did have this container right here. And I poured some nail polish in this container. And I soaked it. I mean, I literally soaked my nails. And even the process of soaking it, I was like, are you kidding me? This is still taking a while to come off. So I was really kind of disappointed with that. Will I try it again? My, they said at my job, look, go, what apartment I work at. And what I, I work like in a shoes department place. But they, it's, a, it's, it's a big place and they have different departments, you know. And the girl said, if you don't like it, you can bring it back. I'm going to talk to her about it and let her know what happened and get her opinion and you know, I might take them bottles today with me and go. I think I'll take them off one day and go and talk to her and let her know what happened and see what she suggests and everything. Should I give the gel a try again? You leave a comment and let me know what you think. Have you tried gel? Have you tried an OPI gel? Or have you tried any type of gel? Did you like it? Did you did not like it? Leave me a comment below and let me know. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel. Let's talk. Let's talk and let's let's go on this journey together. So it is 2.36. I have to be working today at 4 o'clock. I'm going to have a, like a little late night shift today, which is going to be really in interesting. So that's my collection of nail polish. And let's put the ones I'm not going to wear today. I'm not going to go with this one, even though it looks really beautiful. It all depends on what I'm wearing today. Because uh, I really wanted that. I really wanted a red color. This red, red, red color. So. And I love that one. It's not red, but it's beautiful. It is so gorgeous. So what I'm going to do today. I'm really debating between. This one, it dries well fast. And it says Sally Hansen Instant Dry. So I might go, I have three different things I'm thinking about right now. I might give this one a try again. I might do it on my day off. I'm not sure yet. So it's between these two. I want something that, I don't like to rush to work, but I I have packed my lunch and everything. So I have to decide what I want to do. For sure, for sure. Sally Hansen, I'm excited. I will promote this in a heartbeat. OPI. The base coat, top coat, nail strengthener, that is my to go. That that's something I'll keep in my purse when I'm gonna have no nail polish on and I need to paint my nails. I will put that on. I'm telling you, you want long, strong, healthy nail, go out there and buy. Please get OPA, top coat, base coat, nail strengthener, and don't forget your vitamins. Okay, so I'm going to put this stuff away, and this one, I'm going to talk to my coworker about it. In fact, I'll leave it out, take a picture so she can see it. And now I need to get ready for work. So I just want to share with you what's going on, how my nails are going. And as you can see, hopefully with the light and everything, it has a little bit of redness still because I was trying to take the nail polish off and everything. This is this hand is grown so much. It's really, really long, as you can see. My nails have got really, 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 really long. And this one here, the the long, but I need to take some more care of them and everything. So it needs a little more love with it. So I have to go get ready for my day, pack my lunch, and I'm eventually trying to get up coffee. My husband's talking to his doctor right now. That's another video. He found out a couple months ago he's diabetic. Well, the good news is he's not taking insulin or like that. But that man, when I'm at work, I come home. He's having a donut. I'm like, what? Did I miss something? A donut? Yeah, he's he's having a donut. So he talked to his doctor. You know, he, when he sees Dr. again, I'm going to go with him and kind of know his doctor know what he's doing. So anyway, I want to say thank you for watching my YouTube video. And 
there's more to come. So have a blessed day. Merry Christmas, everybody. Stay safe. A lot's going on in this world. But um, my next video, I will upload it tonight, and you will see what I decided to do my else. So keep stay tuned, and your girl is going to take Pampity's little. They need love. They need some love. They, they're crying out for attention. So I'll see you soon, and I'm so excited. Take care. Love you.